And now the final thing we're gonna take a look at is how to add team members to your workspace. So to add team members, we wanna come over here to the name of your workspace, click on it, and then click on manage users. And here we can see that currently there's just one user, which is me, and we can invite people just simply by email. We can just enter their email right here. So let's just say one, two, three, four at gmail.com. And then we can also add a role for this new team member. So if we add this person as a member, then this person will have access to all of the spaces that are currently public in my workspace. We can also add people as guests, but the guests will not be able to have access to entire spaces. They have to be invited to specific folders, lists, or tasks. And then you can also add people as admin and they just have all the rights that you can have in your entire workspace. So maybe let's just add a member and click on invite and here because all of my spaces are private we can choose what space they should have access to. Let's say this is a marketing employee. So I'm going to just choose the marketing space and click on add to spaces. And now this person has received an email and they can just click on it, create their ClickUp account, and then they automatically have access to my workspace or whatever I, I have given them access to. Now let's go back to our workspace and look at how we can make spaces public because again, every team member of the workspace will have access to all of the spaces that are public. So maybe if you have a library of documents that are applicable to all of your team members, you wanna make that space public. Let's for example, say our events space should be public. We can just go to it, click on the three dots, then go to sharing and permissions. And here we can click on make public and close the window. And when we reload the page, we should be able to see that the lock icon next to the space we've just made public has disappeared. Now let's also take a look at how to add guests to specific parts of the workspace. We can add them to lists, to folders and to tasks. So let's say we're gonna go to the marketing space and add a guest to one of our campaigns. Let's say this one right here. We just go to the three dots, go to sharing and permissions, then type in the email of the guest. So I'm just gonna type in a random email and choose it here. And then I'm gonna switch it from member to guest. And then here I can also define the access. So should they be able to have full access, just be able to edit things, comment on things, or maybe they just should be able to view things. So I'm gonna keep it to full and then click on invite. And now this person has already received an email where they get a link and they get access to your ClickUp list that you have given them access to.